The new Nigeria People's Party, NNPP, has expressed optimism that the party will produce the next governor in Edo State, chairman of the screening committee, Abdul Rahman Abubakar, who made this known during the screening exercise conducted for the governorship aspirants in Abuja, the nation's capital, this Wednesday, said with the profile of the party, the four aspirants are sellable. With the profile of our party today, we are very much hoping that one of these four gentlemen you are seeing here will become the next governor of Edo State by the special grace of God. So that's why we want to look at them, we want to look at, chat with them, look at their faces, uh, look at the checklist of what our parties require and make sure that whoever is selected as a candidate, you know, representative of our party, is a person that you can take to the bank. It's sellable. And that's the main purpose we are here this morning or this afternoon. We'll be very much interested in whoever becomes our candidate. Our interest is that we should produce, by the grace of God, the next governor of Edo State. And the kind of governance, the example we are laying in Kano State, should also move to Edo State by the end of this year, God willing. So that has been our desire. So for us as a party, we have uh, arranged a level playground for all those ones who are going to be screened today. We decided to make it very transparent so that nobody will say that he has been screened out or he has not been screened out or he has been screened in. We want everybody, democracy, to play in its fullest. So that is why we brought very serious uh, executives of the party at the national level and the state and some of our colleagues, professors are here who are taking this screening and we believe that we are going to give them a level playground for all of them to be screened properly and then they have been cleared and commence their primaries by Friday. The governorship's aspirants of the new Nigeria People's Party also expressed confidence in the party that it will pick a credible candidate that will represent the party well in the forthcoming election. They, however, pointed out what they intend to do for the people of Edo State if they eventually win in the forthcoming election. I have uh, provided the credentials I have to them, and it is up to them to, to determine that. But uh, based on my thinking, I would say, and based on Nigeria Constitution, I would say yes, I meet. I am here to turn Edo into the industrial hub of West Africa. And how am I planning to do that? I am planning to make sure that in the Edo State we generate electricity, power, and that is the bedrock for water, that is the bedrock for processing of farm products, that is the bedrock for security, that is the bedrock for bringing industries into Edo State. By the special grace of God, I think it will give me an edge over every other person. Is, uh, I'm a grassrooter. I, I started with PDP since 1998, where PDP was formed, and I uh, have been on ground with PDP, so everybody know me in Edo State. Uh, I am with the youth and everybody, so I know the problem of Edo, I know the problem of my people, and uh, we are always together. Uh, my plans for the people of Edo State, like I told you, that I am on ground. I'm somebody that is going uh, everywhere by foot, by road. I, I have never fly from Abuja to Edo State. If I am coming back, I always pass through the roads for, for me to know what are what my people need. So the road for them to transport their goods will be put in place because I know exactly what they need. They need, they need a, a lot. <coughs> they need water. They need roads. And they need uh, education. And they need uh, to be taken care of head-wise. So that, those are major things that I think a common man needed. I've been a, grass, a grassroots man in Edo State. I'm born and live in Edo State. I've never lived outside Edo State. I'm not a foreigner. And I'll be with them, and I'll be doing my great work with them. And I'll continue with what I'll be doing. We were coming to take out the existing big parties. We were coming with a different force, a different orientation, a different belief and approach that once we come on board, we'll be able to give the people, the ordinary people 
a proper orientation of how politics should be in the state so that we are able to give them the dividend of democracy and bring the kind of development that they so desire. So for that reason, so reason, because you can see what is happening in Kano, we believe we can also move that same kind of crowd in Edo State. With the expression of interest form put at 11 million, the chieftains of the new Nigeria People's Party said NNPP is not a money-making party as the party is out to ensure Nigerians enjoy dividend of democracy. Thank you.